So after watching Selena the series part 1, you were either really in love with the show, or you were really disappointed. I was on this side. What's going on you guys, James here with another real reaction, and today has been a day full of trailers. I just dropped my reaction for the new Loki trailer, you can find that right at the top of the screen, but today we're going to get into Selena the Series Part 2, Netflix just released the trailer, the show actually concludes that final half releases on Netflix May 4th. I will be bringing you my review of course, and if you missed my review for Part 1, it's right at the top of the screen. Now this show is definitely considered a disappointment among many fans, and myself included, because I do like Selena's music. Now, I'm not a super fan, but from the mega fans I spoke to, they did not like this show and they felt that Christian Serratos was miscast. I happen to like her. I mean, she was fine, but I do think maybe she was a little misdirected. See, I think this entire series went for the very melodramatic soap opera type, and I don't think that vibe worked very well. It was a little too floaty, a lot of fluff, not enough grounded, raw emotion like we got in the Jennifer Lopez film. Now, I do want to stay optimistic, and I'm hoping that they can nail it here with part two but part one left a lot to be desired so before we get into the trailer guys if it's your first time here at the channel welcome to real james where we react to a lot of movies and tv stuff right here for you so go ahead and hit the big red button below subscribe to the channel and tap on the bell so you'll be the first one in the comments smash that like button and let me know down below guys did this trailer work for you or are you still really disappointed with the direction of this series Alrighty, y'all let's get into it No doubt she has the look. See? I she's got the energy. Oh, that's eight. No, it's not eight. Ah, oh, yeah, see? I'm telling you, she has the look, man. And he was actually pretty funny too, in part one. Is this trailer gonna just be this? I mean I know it's a teaser. That's A B, right? No, wait, I'm not sure. Timeout. Is A B even in this? <laughs> Yeah, and I, I did like her sister, and that, that performance was pretty solid. But is the trailer just going to be this? Because they've already filmed part two, from what I've read. Okay. Y'all, I'm starting to think that this is the entire teaser trailer. I mean, the song is dope, not gonna lie. It's super catchy. <laughs> but, guys, oh man. No, this is not how they should have done this. Okay, oh boy. That's a problem. <laughs> Yo, we need to talk about this a little bit. Oh my gosh. I am really shocked that this was what they decided to roll out with, especially after the negative backlash for part one. So after all of that time in between part one to now, this is what we get for a trailer. This should have been something to hopefully alleviate some of the wounds that fans felt in the first half of this series. And I thought that maybe this teaser trailer would have given us a little bit more to look forward to, but unfortunately I'm exactly where I was at the end of part one. So yeah, I don't think that did that for me. It didn't do anything for me to be honest with you. It's nice to see Christian Serratos and her sister and the band and I just kind of wanted more, right? There's something to be desired, especially with the way part one ended where, you know, Selena and her boyfriend, they have this weird argument with their father and then the boyfriend gets kicked out and whatnot. That seemed to be a very crucial point in Selena's life that the show kind of glossed over. So I was hoping, okay, in this trailer, maybe we're going to start to get a focus on that to give us some sort of hope that they won't just throw that entire storyline off to the side. But yeah, guys, this is disappointing, man. Man, I just, you know what? I think that they should have went back to the drawing board with exactly how they executed the rollout for this. A poster would have been fine, but if it was going to be a trailer, it needed to be a little bit more than that. Now, guys, let me know what you think of that teaser trailer down below in the comments. And if you haven't already, smash that big red button so you don't miss out on my review. Stay subscribed to the channel because we're going to be talking about it. I'm guessing they're going to release another trailer as we get closer to May. But I mean, we're really close to May. And I figure since they've already filmed the second half, we would have just got an official trailer anyway. So, all right, crossing my fingers. I hope we get an official trailer very soon. All right, y'all. I'll catch you at the next screening.